Hi, I'm Josh, and this is Cars and Joshy. Hey, welcome back to Cars and Joshy. Uh, this episode's just going to be kind of a little bonus episode. I named the channel Cars and Joshy because it's obviously a play on cars and coffee, and it's a big car culture scene, and lots of different kinds of cars, and I'm a big car culture person, so it doesn't matter. Uh, I like all different kinds of cars, trucks, whatever. Um, you can tell I'm restoring an El Camino and I'm driving an F-150. It uh, doesn't matter to me if it gets good reviews and it's reliable. Service history on the vehicle is good. I'll buy it. doesn't matter if it's a uh, GMC, Chevy, Ford, Dodge. Uh, scratch that. No Dodge. This video is going to be more about what I'm going to do to my truck. Uh, basically, just taking the running boards off. Nothing hard, difficult about that. I have a buddy that recently purchased a Toyota Tundra 4x4. I've been looking for something to do with the family since we've been cooped up inside COVID, social distancing, all that kind of stuff. And I wanted something to get the family out of the house. And we had talked about uh, going to an off-road park. So we're going to do that. Uh, I'm going to remove the running boards and I, I'll video some of that stuff uh, tomorrow when we head out to the park. I made it up under the truck and looks like this will be pretty easy. I just got eight bolts to take off. Those two there, those two there, and then the same thing down on the other side that holds them on. So should be a pretty quick and painless job. Take this off. Safety first. They don't make glasses for your ear canals though. So I was pulling my nuts off. I didn't want to end up losing one in the mud or something. One of the ones up here fell into the boxed frame and rolled all the way down here where there's no hole to fish it out. So I was trying to fish it out with a magnet. All right, I think I just gave myself quite a bit of extra ground clearance by removing those. All right, we're out here at Northwest OHV with my boy Jay Philly. What's up, YouTube? The F-150 and the Tundra, and they are both stock suspension, but uh, we're going to have some fun anyways. Been having some fun, but it's a good time. 